I'll start. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is Golden Fox, and welcome to another edition of Golden Fox Plays. In this one, we're taking a look, or I'm actually playing a game of Donkey Kong Country, and as obvious, um, I'm not um, alone in this. So joining with me is Tune Critic Y2K. Hello? Pussy lips. Hold on. Tune, are you there? <laughs> Hey, what's good, amigos? Toon Critic here. <laughs> okay, that is not how you do that. Apparently, I was muted. What's good, people? How's it going? <laughs> wow, everything is like freaking like outtakes and mishaps today. So yeah, Toon Critic Guy 2K, Lightning Bliss, Sapphire Heart Song, and Lucifer himself, Aeon of Dreams. Hi. <laughs> Want to touch your butts, but I'm only here okay with that. So yeah, as obvious, we are playing Donkey Kong Country. This is a very wonderful game to play. It's got be it's obviously known for beautiful graphics, but it's got some very solid gameplay, and not to mention this helped ex um, extend the lifespan of the Super Nintendo. And it, like to this day, like it, like okay, so it looks very <laughs> pixely. It still holds up to this day. What's so funny, Bliss? Dude, you hit puberty. That was me. Because <laughs> <laughs> apparently I sound like a, a more lower two critic when I. Oh my god, <laughs> that's saying something. <laughs> I, am, I am on my back and I am rocking. <laughs> and then God said, "No, this boy needs a voice." And God said, "I have the best idea. Hold my beer." And then he grabbed Lightning Bliss, <laughs> added some helium, and sort it in and said, good enough. <laughs> <sighs> okay, let's just get this shit started. <laughs> oh. oh my, okay, somebody's really sucking up to you in the chat, Aeon. Aeon, yep. why are you so gorgeous and sexy and beautiful? <laughs> well, that person's been... Because and, the booty. Uh, yeah, that it's all about the booty. Alright, oh, and... <gasps> <laughs> do, 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 do. Yeah, there's. Uh, I always like to make like funny like. I always like to mock the sound effects in like Super Nintendo games. I loved this game. I remember loving this one a lot. Okay, if you I guys were playing this and getting my ass kicked by it. Yeah, uh, this game like most notoriously is the minecart stage. Like that game is known to kick so many people's asses. I remember how frustrating it was when I was a kid. Um, but regardless of that, this. This game definitely holds a nostalgic place in my heart. Like, uh, from yeah. my memories, like, I didn't actually own the game, but my cousins did. And on occasion, whenever we went to go visit, um, visit their house, we would always come to the Super Nintendo and say, Let's play some DK Country, man! And just, like, remembering the amazing soundtrack this game has. It's got a, it's not just great graphics, it's just that it's got really, really good music that holds up to this day. It's very melodic. It's very well written out. It's it's not only not only that. It's so atmospheric uh, later in the stages. Which... Yeah, I loved the, I loved the music. I loved the the levels, the level changes, and I guess I was one of those that actually enjoyed the the minecart level. Oh, the minecart level! Like, there's some people like I remember some friends who said, "Dude, I could take on the minecart level. Give me the controller. I could take it on. Bro. Are you I want sure? To with this." <laughs> No, that, that's well, when I, was... I can just imagine everyone screwing up, and you're just like, you see everyone oh, screw yes. up and like hold it's my Bambi. beer. Yeah, like okay. Oh but... wait, no, it's not Bambi, it's Rambi. Rambi, yeah. But the thing, uh, <laughs> how could you confuse a rhino for a deer? Well, I forgot its name. It's been years. Hello, Kiandaga. Oh, you are such a cute rhino. <laughs> <laughs> a rhino? Oh. <laughs> uh, wait, but, is yeah. I in the chat or no? Oh, hello, Cinder, you cute pygmy rhino. Cinder? Who the fuck people, is Cinder? My husband is home. I am going to make him some dinner. I'll be right back. All right. Okay. Okay. So, yeah. Bliss I'm going to be here to entertain you all the new cute sub alicorn. Yep. So, blah, yeah, Bliss is uh, simply BRB. For anybody who comes back, we will have to inform. And uh, in the meantime, um, Sapphire, you're going to take over. So... I I will be the most adorable rainbow alicorn ever, and if anybody calls me cute, I will rip their face off with my demon monster that looks like a fluffy rainbow. <laughs> Golden Fox, what are your thoughts on Donkey Kong Country Returns and Tropical Freeze? I have not played those. As far as any current uh, Nintendo platformers go, 
I've only been up to the Wii, and I haven't even touched any other Mario 3D games with the exception of Mario uh, 64. I have not okay, played Sunshine, uh, I have not played Galaxy, I have no expectations whatsoever about um, Super Mario Odyssey. So. Alright, now, um, you got another one that says, so, so Golden, how is that SNES Genesis device? Ah, uh, yes, Does that's right. Um, um, uh, Metal Forge, a.k.a. Panzer Fox, a.k.a. a bunch of other random names that I can't keep at the top of my head, sent me a, a copy of a retro um, a retrogen cartridge that allows you to put any Genesis game in there and play through the SNES. Which is a pretty useful tool if, like, let's say you have a collection of uh, Genesis games, but you don't have uh, the Genesis yet. I think it was a nice little uh, addition to have. It's kind of weird when you have to set it up because you have to have individual cables to plug it into and not to mention when you do plug it in you're gonna get a lot of fuzzy feedback you're gonna hear the sound you're gonna hear the game but it's gonna be very weak uh, so along with that he also sent me a copy of a game called Afterburner which I think the game was okay I still have much to learn um, he did like he meant like he would beat himself up saying that he wished that he had sent me a Sonic 2 instead I'm like Dude, it's fine. It's nice to try different games every once in a while, or a game that I've never played before. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, it's a pretty um, it's a pretty useful tool. It's not the best thing in the world, but it's definitely, like, convenient if, let's say, something... Wow, you are Genesis. breezing through this. Well... Also, Willow yeah. Steel, I deserve to be an Alicorn? No, the last time I was an Alicorn, I was willing to burn... A whole entire town alive in protest towards uh Caden, oh, so damn. no. I, I shouldn't be an Alcorn or else oh, things are what? going to burn. <sighs> what? I was supposed to take on the armor dildo and I got my ass kicked. You know, I, I actually <laughs> Yeah. Armor you know, dildo? That's what I heard. <laughs> the armor that dildo. One. What are you too <laughs> tight for a normal dildo? I I walked into <laughs> that one. Oh my god. I feel like <laughs> it handles the pressure. Um, something else I want to add. Um, whenever it comes to the de like, sometimes like like I said before, I uh, sometimes I like to mock the sound effects of um, a lot of Super Nintendo games. Uh, but I also like talking about or just like referencing how funny it is or how I think it's funny whenever uh, something happens in a game. For instance, deaths. In Donkey Kong Country, there's a little pause, like a second of a pause when you take a hit. As if the game was taunting you, letting you know, yeah, you fucked up. Or it's like, it was at that moment, Donkey Kong realized, he fucked up, man! <laughs> but no, um, it's just, it just, uh, it has that little bit of a pause, and it's funny. Or I think it's funny, it just goes like, ah! Let me guess who died. Some Final yep. Fantasy 6 hate. I, I don't play Final Fantasy, though. Neither do I. I play Final why, Fantasy. Why can I hate? Why would I hate something that I haven't even played? I have played Final Fantasy VI, and I freaking love that game. It's like that's it's like one of the best games ever made. I don't know why somebody would hate the game. Well, I know I don't hate it. One, I've never played it, so I can't really hate something I've never played. Thank you for following uh, Jack Juan fourteen. Yay! Foxy has another follower. Yep. And it just keeps on going. And they don't stop coming, and they don't stop coming to the rules. <laughs> I, I lost track of the lyrics. Hey, now, you're an all-star. I don't know if this was still in the plans, but you know how, um, after BronyCon, you and Key were going up north to New York? Oh, yes. Uh, she's got uh, some relatives in uh, New York City. And after BronyCon... After or before? After BronyCon. Afterwards, we're yeah, taking... Yeah, because I... Go ahead. Oh, no, I was about to ask, because there was an idea that was proposed, and I'm still up for this, unless something has changed, of instead of you guys taking, like, a bus, I would just drive you up there. That's pretty I nice passed of New you. York. I passed New York City I anyway, and I remember, like... I drive with someone who drives a million miles an hour. <laughs> okay. Hey, he... Hey, sports mode gets the job done. It does. See, Toon knows the gnosis of sports mode. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, yeah, um, we I appreciate mean, the I've offer. Been in, I've been in a few car accidents because of my dad's reckless driving, and I just don't want to be in a... And, I, and being in cars that go really fast actually freak me out. 
No, it's understandable. Okay, no worries. It's completely understandable. I know what it, uh, what that feels like. Actually, I should share something. My brother, uh, his first car was a green 97 Honda, a uh, Civic. Mm -hmm. And yeah. he was... It, this was because of the influence of the whole hype of um, uh, the Fast and the Furious. That's, yeah, because yeah, there were he, Honda Civics in there. Yeah. And everyone wanted a Civic after that. Well, not just that. Just like he and his friends always liked to do street racing and they did it so many times like i remember once he did a street racing and was going so fast right in the middle of the street crossing over two long freaking like rows of traffic i'm like oh my god i am terrified okay at least i'm not like that yeah um i but like at that alone when that happened i just like i busted him i told him I, I just told mom, like, okay, I can't do this shit anymore. And he got mad and butthurt saying, I don't trust you. Well, you know what? I don't want to trust you. You're, you're being so reckless. I'm surprised you haven't been pulled over for that shit. No, uh, like... I think the worst I've ever done at, like, um, most miles is, like, 90. Although that was an accident, considering I was going way faster than I should have on a 65-mile highway. I didn't get caught, though. Huh. Oh, I no, Deary, I... I realized, oh, shit, I'm going, like, 90. I've only gotten one speeding ticket and zero moving accidents, despite, despite what people shit. say about my driving, because Toon could point this out. I was totally... Uh, what is it? I was, like, the most zen I ever could be, because I was driving him from the Newark airport to the uh, resort. Yeah. And you were just casually asking, by the way, how fast are we going? And I looked down at the speedometer, and I'm like, oh, yeah, 90, 95. Oh my and god. And I paused, I'm like, really? <laughs> yeah, dude, I was just like, ha I had like, my head leaning on one of my arms, and I was one-handing the steering wheel, and we're just totally zen in the car. <laughs> That's so, how you do uh, zen driving. <laughs> on a lighter note, and I think this is a, this will be an interesting discussion, Fox, have you ever heard of the Donkey Kong Country TV series? <sighs> Yay. Don't that's get a, that's a yes, probably. I I wanted to like the series because I loved the game. But when I saw the first episode again where DK was doing some little pretend game with his walkie-talkie, I'm just like, dude, I can't take this shit seriously. When it came to the game, it had something that was based on an adventure. At least that's something I could say. What the fuck was up with Donkey Kong right there? No, the, the, the least I could say about the Super Mario Brothers Super uh, Adventure series or the Super Show, at least it had some adventure, despite how bizarre it was. Like, you have Indiana Jones, who has no face drawn on him, and a bunch of other weird-ass shit, at least it but served its purpose, whereas DK Country was like... <sighs> I, I can't take this seriously. Don't you think maybe the fact that it was so bad is why it's so memorable? I'm yeah. back. Isn't that how you Welcome feel, back. Back. Isn't that how you feel <laughs> about Sonic Boom, though? Yeah, that is. That's honestly how I feel about it. I feel like once a show recognizes, like, if it's shit and becomes self-aware about it, then it's funny. Like, oh, you were the talking dog, about the show. Because oh, I was going to say, regardless of which one you think is worse, Sonic, was, Sonic 06 kind of had the more uh, memorable part to it. Because Sonic 06 is when we had, like, high expectations for Sonic 06 being good, and Sonic didn't necessarily have that reputation of being shit it was the complete opposite yeah this is well this wasn't like the start of darkness like pe yeah a lot of people were not into shadow the hedgehog with its numerous problems also also but like people dark. actually had expectations for this of it going back to okay shadow the hedgehog was just one game surely they're not gonna fuck this sonic adventure title up or well, they did. Well, Adventure started. went over really well. They really started fumbling after Sonic 06. They started fumbling because then Sonic and the Secret Rings came out, and then Sonic and the Black Knight came out, and then um, the game that also to... broke Aaron. <laughs> and then uh, fuck. Try... And then and then the worst one in my opinion, which is Sonic Free Riders, came out for the Kinect. And everybody's just like, okay, what the fuck? But then, like, Sonic Colors and Sonic Generation came around, and then everyone's just like, yay, Sonic doesn't suck anymore! And then Sonic Broom, Boom Rise of Lyric came out, and everyone's just like, oh my god, what the fuck is this? Everyone fell for the Sonic cycle. <laughs> yeah. Also, also, 
there was a question in chat, like, somebody said, like, Toon has a nice squishy butt. I think I know why that person knows that information. Oh my god. Why? Tony's got a nice bedonk bedonk. I was gonna, I was gonna yeah. say, oh, are, are we just gonna pull someone into the call and that person's gonna take off their mask and be like, it's me, Mo. <laughs> Can you imagine how awesome of a surprise that would be? <sighs> this, yes. victory, uh, this victory, this By the I way, just... yes, Scargrim, someone did confess. They, they emailed me through uh, my main email, and they're just like, hey, heard you like Sonic and the Black Knight. Guess what? I'm sending two more your way. Oh, God. oh my God! Do you know who did it? I know who did it, but I don't at the same time. It was like a weird ass email, but I'm not gonna give it out for the sake of people sending him hate. But I just read it, and I didn't. He didn't give a name, just that. Hey, I heard you liked it. I'm gonna send more your way, and I'm just like, oh joy. <laughs> I, th I think I know who that is. Who? Who? I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> Because I'm not, I'm not saying it in the sense of oh, I think, I think I'm right per se, but in we'll the sense in of the what if, I, what if I am right and this person gets hate. Oh. Okay, yeah, like, like, yeah, like even okay, guys, if you find out who it was, don't send your hate. Like, it, it's very uh, immature to do that. Um. <laughs> what? Oh my god. What are you guys? What are you guys laughing about? What's going on? In the, it's in our chat, our, our our Skype chat. Oh, but yeah, getting back to a timer. getting back to getting Sonic. back to do the Donkey Kong Country minutes. TV series. Actually, actually no. Oh yeah, um, yeah. Like the animation obviously has not aged well, but much of that's to be expected because CGI is always a growing process of um, having more technological advancements to allow more detail and everything to happen. So, it would not be very fair to criticize. I mean, you look at, uh, what is it, Reboot and Transform, uh, Beast Wars, which I thought That's the show was... Bad. Yeah, like, I thought those shows were great. Yeah, the animation has not aged well. Like, it looks like a student oh, no. project by comparison. Um, but... I think what happened with it in the end, uh, the, the Donkey Kong Country series, is that it started off fine, it was ridiculous enough for at least people to somewhat enjoy it in a bad way, but I can tell you that the last season they did, they switched animation styles, and it looked, okay, it was funny when it looked bad, but then it got worse, and people were like, oh, okay, this isn't funny anymore, you know, it's, it's like when, a, when they change up the animation on you, like, sometimes you'll notice, like, animation errors as a joke, you can joke at like something for how badly it's animated, yeah. but then, but then when it's actually bad, then you're like, okay, I feel bad now. This is, this is like really Rainbow bad. Like Rainbow Bright reboot bad. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Yes, folks, be aware for the the unfortunate torture of Rainbow Bright that Bliss has to suffer through. She died for your <laughs> sins. I cry for your sins. No, Bliss I'm not died. dead. I cried. It was a joke. It was a joke. And Bliss we are in... Dead. Folks, we are now entering the most notorious level in the entire game. Minecart Carnage. Here we oh go. Oh boy, good luck. I, I, I played... Remember, dude? I played these levels when you were there. Ooh. I don't think I even got past Wee. this part. I think I, I think I rage quit. <laughs> You know, I'm Why just... am I not surprised? Okay, I'm being a little random here, but when I cried tears of despair after doing the review, um, if anybody even want to drink my tears at that point, because it probably either be too sweet or it would be. <laughs> I don't know. You know, a single tears are not salty; they're just sugary. Yeah, and a single drop could give you diabetes. <laughs> you need to weaponize that uh, shit and uh, put that in like a <laughs> and put that like in Fidel Castro's like fucking oh, tea on, or something that'll kill him. Oh, no, he's I know. Dead. Oh, oh, Bliss killed him. Oh, That's why. Oh snap! Okay, good oh save. snap! Yeah. I'm making progress, yo. You know don't I'm jinx your. Okay, first off, never say yo. Second, don't <laughs> jinx yourself. Hold on. Ah, oh, damn it. No! See, see what I tell you. This, hold on, hold on. Let's wait until after this. I remember that I had to do it many times, but then I mastered it, and when I did, I was like, "Bitch, yeah, I own your ass." Hey guys, <laughs> what? Yeah. Okay, go ahead. No, oh, come on. I was going to oh. say, I imagine when Lightning Bliss cries, 
if you take her tears and put them in a bottle and you shine it near light, it will it will make pure rainbows. What? Well, I mean, rainbows are just refractions of light through water particles, so. Okay. We, we like make it a like, thing that Blissey's tears are like Phoenix tears, tears that like cure like you of cancer. The blue light <laughs> that you see well, the other thing that makes me go what is that um, whenever she cries, everything around her turns um, turns into the grayscale. I know. She, yeah. But her tears are literally the color. That's what I'm saying. Oh come on! While everything is being turned around her, colors. she's making, she's making it come out of her body. Huh. All right. So back to uh, the mind card uh, carnage. Actually, can, can someone add me to the sketch? Did you pause it or did it freeze on me? You, you know what? Sure. Yeah, um... Never Brett, hand me the charger. Alright, hang on, hang on, hang on. Yep, alright. So, back on... Back on the track. Back on the track! Dun, 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 dun. It's like, imagine Back to the Front from Metallica, but replace the lyrics with this. Back to the future? No, Back to the Front. Why are you... Never mind. Like, Alright, here we go, here we go. Woo! I remember screwing up a lot on the track brakes when you're going uphill and you have to jump. Yeah. Whoop! I remember oh. screwing up a lot on those. Yep. Alright. Sorry for gold not dying yet. Damn it! Why'd you do Safi? Why'd you have to you do that? You jinxed us! You know what? How do you guys feel about me putting up a screen share so that way you can see any current events? Yes, please. Yeah, oh. this, this could definitely work. Hang on. Um... Alright, um... Here we go, share screens. And... Alright, cool. So now they can actually, you can actually see what's going up to date. Alright, here we go. Yay! Yay! Yep. And whoa! <laughs> Alright, now this is much better. Yeah, instead of having to wait a few seconds for, like, to see what's going on. This, yeah, this is the is... one thing Discord doesn't have, but when it has it, Skype will die. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, I have grown to dislike Discord more, because trying to find the, the chat groups and trying to find your contacts, it's very confusing. I don't yeah. think it's that confusing. I figured it out really quickly. Alright, here yes, we go. Yes, I'm learning it. And... I'm still trying to figure it out. <laughs> oh, come on! Oh. That was some bullshit. <laughs> yeah, can somebody add a <laughs> key into the call? Damn it. Oh, sure. Hang on. Alright, we're being added right now. Add who? Uh, Keyframe. She's going to be listening on the call oh. because I'm using my headphones. So that way... Um, Crap, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> what Here's happened? Echo, I know. <clears throat> hmm. Ow, fuck! I hate it when that happened. Yeah, Western mm. 45, I use Adobe yeah. Flash. Alright. Are you on the call? Or no? No, I just added her. Okay, cool. Be sure to put that one on mute, so that way, um... Yeah. I'm eating nerds. Alright, so you win, or...? Yay! Hold on, hold on. Did Skype crashed on me. Oh. Ow. Oh. Ow. Oh. Skype, you had one job. Hey, is anybody else's, like, screen share for Golden, like, frozen, or is that just me? No, it's on pause. pause. I, if, you click away from an if you click away from an emulator, then it will pause the game. Yeah, I know. I just didn't know if, like, Fox had, like, you know, froze up, or if it was, like, the emulator. No. Okay. Your music's still going and everything. There we go. Alright, cool. Mmm, I like nerds. I, I so. You are a nerd. Oh, oh. No, I'm a geek. I can hear, I can hear myself. Difference. You're a nerd. Uh, well, I muted. Okay. Okay. So I don't know what you want. So why can't I, I, I hear myself? Hear myself? Mm. Whoa. Because she's not muted. I am muted. Now she's muted. Testing. 
Justin. All right, cool, cool. All right. Now that that's taken care of. You can at least hear the call, right? Yep. All right, cool. All right, here hey. we go. Do 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 do. What? I told them to jump. What? Now you know how I feel. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Um, I can also feel the pain of what, uh, Key had to go through when she was going through the lost levels. <laughs> no, if you really want to know, like, a true cha like, something challenging, apparently Josh in his Kingdom Hearts, uh, final mix, uh, playthrough, mm -hmm. there was a <gasps> delay, there was input delay the entire time. What? He was playing on the hardest difficulty. Oh. Wow. He somehow, so yeah, he somehow managed to beat Proud Mode in Kingdom Hearts with input delay. Wow, you've got to be kidding me. I've never played the Lost Levels. Um, you good don't luck. Wanna... <laughs> Seeing Keyframe play them, I'm not sure if I want to. It's not What's a thunder? Fun. Uh, Sundere. It's like a uh, person who has a mix of, uh, who's aloof, but also very sweet. Like, once you get to know them. Aggressive, but has, uh, but inside is a softie, basically. Uh, in real life, I'm actually not that aggressive. No, it's, seriously, she's so really not like a super anything. Anything. personality. Baka. <laughs> what was that, Peter? It's December. Oh my god, Tune, I imagine your face superimposed on a Japanese schoolgirl with a blush. Ah, no! What? <laughs> Baka. Oh, that's not a terrifying like I like to race. Baka. Guys. We need. We Fuck! Need okay, go ahead. We need to. Someone needs to go find the selfie of Zach. Go find that picture that Zach put up on Twitter of him and Mo, and put some anime eyes on them, pink blushy cheeks. Oh my god. <laughs> no. <Don't> do it. <laughs> do it. No! Damn it! Damn it! I oh, guess I should. Goldie. I guess I should actually use this time to say yes, that guy, Mo, is actually my boyfriend now. So. Wow. Yay. Wow. Sweet. wow. You have a hear that? Congratulations, Zach. Lucas boyfriend. Oh, thank you for the one dollar uh, donation, Reflective Virgin. And a chance of doing Yoshi's what was Island. That here? I said something, I don't know if Keith yeah. said anything. Yay. Um, Yoshi's <laughs> Island, maybe. Um, I still got a couple of things on my plate right now. But at one point, I would like to do, um, Yoshi's Island. That game takes a while to play through. But man, that's so one of the few Mario games I've never played. It's really good. Um, I think if it's it's de I, I definitely think it's more of a Yoshi game than a Mario game. I still don't know why they uh, titled it Super Mario World Two because it's not a Mario game. It's related in the uh, universe, but that's like saying Donkey Kong Country is a Mario game. Hmm. I don't know. I, just... I gotta make a top seven favorite Mario games list at some point. That would be nice. Okay, there's one guy. Yes! I made it! Yay! He made it! It's funny how they dance. Tune. By the way, I thought it was Sundari. If, um... Remember. Fucking Moe's a violinist, right? Have him uh -huh. play, um... Fucking Always Summer by Yellow Card. Seriously. Play Wonderwall! Oh, damn it! Shut up, Key. They okay. can play Key, Yuri on Key, ice. That, every musician that I've spoken to... Always play the joke every time they're like playing in a call. They'll be like, "Anyway, here's Wonderwall." I know, right? I love that joke. <laughs> I I want to see Yuri on Ice art of Tune and Mo just because. So to I have yet to see Yuri on Ice. Is it even that good? I keep hearing people. Yes, it is talk good. About. It is really good. I know Digibro you know, made a video about its type. To Dar Chan, I am still working on the review itself. I'm close to. Finishing the editing portions for my OC, and then I have to add in the video footage and images. Um, I'm hoping to release it on Saturday. Yeah. Uh, what video? My re my review on the reboot. Oh, uh, Rainbow Brights. Uh, no, Can uh, so, you hear so, my uh, heart beat? Guys. So, um, last night, I was with, I was, I was in the, I was like oh, really bored. So, me and my friends marathon Hell's Kitchen. Nice. And we, uh, there was this one part where they had to taste something and then recreate the dish based on taste. And this one guy won because while everyone else used parsley, he used watercress. So he came up with this thing. <laughs> the guy just starts yelling, 
I shit watercress. <laughs> <laughs> and, my wow. Kate, and my friend Kaden just couldn't stop laughing every time that we said it. Because <laughs> the, wow. the guy who guys, guy who got it was this big, burly, ginger Chicago man. Yay! And they kept showing Break the him, gingers. They kept showing flashback clips of him screaming and everything. So we're just like, <laughs> his battle cry is, I shit watercress! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> so if he's a ginger, doesn't mean he has no soul? What? 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 Nothing. Okay. Don't say nothing after you say something! Repeat what you said! I- never mind. I said Set if fire! he's a ginger, so he has no soul? <laughs> Well, gingers have souls. Oh, yeah, here mother, we go. My niece, my brother, mm. are gingers. You watch yourself, uh, Sappy. <clears throat> this stage, oh, hold on. Mm -hmm. This fucking stage is more frustrating than the minecart one. This is the stage I rage quit on. This is where I stopped. I could not <clears throat> get past this. Let me see. Stop, stop and go, go station. station. I need a I need a reminder of what this level was. You had to hit the uh um, the ghost of the stop stages every time, like every couple of seconds, it turns back to go. And there's a bunch of enemies that run back and forth at a really fast pace. It's absolutely frustrating. You'll see it when you um you'll know it when you see yeah. it. Yeah. So here we go. <sighs> here we go. Oh my god, this level. Yes. Oh, and the thing that's also annoying is that you have to be mindful of those freaking alligators, those little tiny alligators when you're on the run. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! This shit is intense. I should mention, this game was considered one of the toughest games on the uh, console. I remember we beat it, though. Damn it. I don't even recall if it was hard for me. I remember right. I had a lot of fun with I'm that. I'm already at a, um, I'm already at a checkpoint. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Get the fuck moving. Yay, Takka, me. Ow! Ooh, oh, okay, cool. Get up there, get up there! Oh, God. Go, go, Oh, go. shit! Ah! Oh, 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 God! Oh, oh, God! <laughs> I don't want to hear those sounds from Fox. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no! Fox oh my god, that's a terrible place. Those noises. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! <laughs> ah! 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 Go! Go! Peter, ah! <laughs> you and I are thinking the same thing, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> How the fuck did you get through that in one go? But Fox I, that was, is dude, that was sheer, submissive, so dude, it's cute. Dude, dude, that was sheer luck. Oh my god. God damn. <laughs> Battery, dude. I'm saving. I am not going back. Oh. <laughs> That's how everybody feels, especially with like me when I feel underprepared and I somehow make it through like a friggin' Pokemon gym. Like I am saving. I am never like, yeah. <laughs> <sighs> okay, so after this stage and um, what is it? Um, the the second boss. I'm gonna end this uh, end this episode and then start the next one. Whew. That! Oh my god. I should have shot in the middle. You died. I didn't die, it was just a bonus stage. You, you, you laughing at me? Oh shit. <laughs> Hang on. That'll take hey, care I of him. Hey, I'm doing shit. Oh, you're talking about the those guys, okay. Yeah, the, yeah. the, the, the big muscular blue douchebags who like to go, ha, 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 You cannot hurt me! In my ass, you can't hurt me. <laughs> I had a freaking TMT barrel, bitch! How do you like that? <sighs> what the fuck are those things that the beavers are freaking riding on? I'm assuming haystacks, but... Oh, those no. are not haystacks. No, this... Or little... they are, uh, That uh, has to be from the same architecture in the stage. Alright, there we go. Time for rare. Okay, okay. Sweet. I got another one of those, uh, bonus stages. Swordfish. Yeah, this one's my least favorite because the items you have to get are very tiny, 
and the fish moves at a very slow pace. Like, he can go fast, but not as fast as, like, the rhino or the ostrich. It, it makes me think this and the underwater stage that I think is in this game make me think of the Barbie game for the SNES. Why? Because I think if I think the Florida part of the Barbie game for the SNES, you have to go to you have an underwater stage where you have to collect stuff. I forgot there ever was a Barbie game for the SNES. There were multiple Barbie games for the SNES. I'm I sure. I'm gonna have to look at that John Tron video again. Yeah, there was. Yeah, there I were, there I actually um. Okay, go ahead. Oh no, I was go just ahead. gonna say, there were like, I think three for the SNES. One was you just traveling around LA being a blonde bimbo, and then there was um, <laughs> one where you traveled the world. Oh, and shit! I think another one was uh, you were a genie. What? Yeah, you were in like this Arabian genie land, and you had to ride magic carpets and stuff. And it was actually a pretty fun game. Um, okay, this is something I didn't know about. Um,. And then after that, they moved to PlayStation and 3D graphics. And shit. Hmm. I don't think there was a Barbie game for the N64. Hmm. I, I remember, like, um, when I was a kid, I had gotten, like, this uh, Barbie, like, mermaid type of thing. Like, they uh, made it so that the... It, it was for, like, this uh, Mertopia type of series or whatever. I was, like, nine mm -hmm. or something. And it came with, like, this DVD that was, like, an interactive game. Oh, God, I hated it so much as a kid. If we had a capture card for GameCube, and I could and I could get the game, mm -hmm. I would totally do a live stream or Let's Play series of the fucking Bratz Rock Angels for the GameCube. Oh, God. Oh, just, get a, just get a DV100. Yeah. Key, or... do you even remember, like, that movie or, like, that whole entire, like, toy line that came out during that Yeah, it was age? either Rock Angels, because I had the PC for that, too, and, or the Diamond Forever one. And I had both of those on game oh. because my parents had no taste. And they were the one who bought me those games because I was a little kid. And all I hey, remember... Key. Ow, damn it. Oh, what, Zach? I have a question. Do you recommend any good Scooby-Doo video games? Oh, that's a good question! Good, good question for you, my boo. Uh, well, okay. My main Mind you, also, the only ones that I've ever played are Mass, uh, what was it? Something Fuck. 100 Frights and Unmasked. Well, okay. One of the good games was the 100 Frights one. The one I was going to say, avoid at all costs, was unmasked. <laughs> oh. Okay, Whoops. Here's, here's the thing. My expansion, because Scooby-Doo and Smurfs are those two properties that you wouldn't think have a lot of video games, and then you look up how many video games you got, they got, and you're like, what the fuck? Um, Holy But for Scooby... This guy's a cakewalk. I played a bunch of the PC games that were the Scholastic Entertainment games. <laughs> Do if people oh, remember yeah. that, the point and click adventures where they help you learn things. Oh yeah, that was a thing. Yeah. Uh -huh. that, um, but the but the other PC Scooby game I had was actually an amusement park that was haunted, and it was a top down thing, and you had to find clues and stuff, and you had to pick who you thought was going to be the villain. It was an interesting game. I don't know what to call the genre, but it was interesting. All right, um, is well, there uh, like anything else left? Because um, I um, I'm just about like over forty minutes. And I'm about ready to start the next episode. Well, okay. Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll just I'll ask again in the second episode. Don't worry. Okay. Yeah, we can continue where we last left off. So yeah, um, we're gonna end part one here. We're gonna continue the next episode. Um, sorry for interrupting you, babe. It's fine. Everyone interrupts me because no one loves me. I love you. Are you sure? Yes. No. Uh, Safi! <laughs> God damn. Uh, I, I know he loves you. I'm just fucking around. See you in the next episode. Alright, so until next time, I'm Golden Fox and keep gaming. <laughs>